Good morning, San Jose Middle School Scorpions. Today is Thursday, March 25th. Thursday already, can you believe it? Students were talking a little bit about getting ready for us all to be back at school um, starting on April 12th. Remember, we'll all be here together, so there'll be twice as many people. So it's really important that we remember the big four rules because some of these rules are going very well and some are not. First of all, you're doing a great job with wearing a mask. Thank you very much. We appreciate that. It makes us all safer. The one that I want to talk to you about is washing your hands and using hand sanitizer. I know that most of you wash your hands in your um, teacher's room as soon as you enter, but as we get more and more people on campus, it's going to be really important for you to use the hand sanitizer that's available all over campus. The minute you walk onto campus in the morning, we want you to use hand sanitizer. Please don't make me chase you around the quad uh, to remind you. You should be in the habit by now of re reaching out for the hand sanitizer whenever you pass one as you're moving from class to class. In your mind, just think about whenever I enter into a new part of the campus, I'm going to use hand sanitizer. This is an easy way to keep us safe. So please remind your friends and do your best. Remember to maintain social distance and don't come to school if you are sick. Seventh grade electives, just reminding you that these um, course descriptions and this is where you put your online class selection. So get those done. We need to use that for planning. And remember, if you don't choose, we'll choose for you. Uh, hey, we have lots of Scorpion Strong shout outs here. So I wanna make sure that we get to these. We're so proud of our Scorpion scholars. Jalen Brown and Austin Cole have been recognized by Ms. Miller as lifelong learners for their positive attitudes and excellent participation. Harley Gilfillan has been uh, recognized by Ms. Craig to be, for being a change maker because uh, she volunteers to help teach her out with chores in the art room and works diligently. Very nice. Thank you, Ms. Craig. Uh, Ms. Craig also wants to recognize Pedro Lopez, who is a community builder who reached out to a new student is consistently friendly and encouraging. Talbot McAndrews has been nominated as a lifelong learner for fantastic participation. She is a hard worker reaching her goals. Darwin Rodas is also being rec recognized as a community builder. Sasa Aceveda has been recognized by Ms. Freed as a lifelong learner. She is a super scholar who always goes above and beyond in her work. And Jaden Martinez is being recognized by Ms. Miller as a community builder because he came up with a way of making math more accessible to other students. Thank you and congratulations, Scorpion Scholars. Here is an opportunity for you to see Hollis Wongwer, who is, let's see, uh, we're gonna, you're gonna to talk about her journey as a creative leader. She's a poet and spoken word artist, and she also does lots of work as a community advocate. If you wanna learn about the music industry, as well as how can we, it can relate to community organizing, you can uh, listen in on this discussion. You do need to register, here's the click right here, uh, and you can use this. This is some more information about her right there. So she is a very interesting person. I think that you might enjoy this presentation. Eighth grade Scorpion Scholars, we are going to do a promotion. So um, you're going to need a gown. So to order your gown, please order, use the forms. We sent them home to your parents. I'll send them home again tonight. Uh, they are due by next Wednesday, the 31st. Bring your completed form to the front office as soon as you can. We are so proud of you. Today is the day for Kona Ice, friends. Yes, you might thought it was yesterday, but to no, know it's today. So at 2.45, ride your bike on over, say hello to friends from a social distance, and buy yourself a Kona Ice. This will be really fun. So you, remember, we will be on campus, so you'll need to wear a mask and maintain social distance. Robotics meets today online at four o'clock. Make sure you have downloaded the programs you need so that you don't miss a thing. Tomorrow, Friday is spirit wear. So remember we wear school color on Fridays. Let's zip it up friends, it's nice and warm outside. We can be wearing spirit wear all the time.
It's Thursday, so you're going to first and third in the morning, first and third in the afternoon. Please do your own work in the middle of the day. Persevere and, of course, make it a great day.